Hello. Hello. Hi, Vanessa. How are you? I'm fine. And you? Great. <clears throat> hello. Hello. Everyone's coming in the class. I'm yeah. fine. And you? Oh, Great. A little bit of an echo, Vanessa. Hello. I close it now. Okay. Hello. Whoa. Things go crazy right when <laughs> the class starts. It's like everybody coming in the class. All right. Let's see if we're filled. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. We have nine cool. people. We have a guy in a cave. A woman looks like in a in a supermarket. We got a guy in a bedroom. We have a woman at work. We have you with who's that on the left hand who's that in that picture Louisa on the left there who's in that picture <laughs> it's who what Robinson I'm going to have to mute you there's a little bit of sound coming from your computer okay I'm muting Robinson uh, okay that's better uh, hi Laura how are you hello haven't seen you in a while. And then there's Gabriel. Yeah. And we got Eris. Hello. All right. Looks like all the sound is better now. Although Robinson, we ha we're having a little bit of. Do you have earphones? Do you have earphones, Robson? <laughs> no. Okay. We're gonna. I'm gonna mute him. So. It's been a while since I taught a class. I was just at the gym. I was running at the gym. I was doing exercise. Gym? The gym. Do you know what I say when I mean the gym? No. Uh, who knows what I, what I mean when I say I was at the gym? Gymnastics. To do, to do exercise. That's right, to go exercise. You can also you, say... Mm -hmm. Are you uh, drinking too? Because I can see a lot of bottles. <laughs> no, that's for later. It's, oh, okay. <laughs> it's, it's 11 a.m. here. I'm not an alcoholic, so I don't drink. Um, looks like we're going to have to really mute Rob's in there because he's making all sorts of noise. Um, a gym is also called a fitness center. Uh, it's where you do exercise. Vanessa's right. So today I was lifting weights. I was lifting weights to make me strong. Um, who here goes to a gym? Anybody go to the gym to exercise? Vanessa does. Who else? No one? Laura? Laura, I thought you spend all of your time on Colingo. How do you have time for a gym? <laughs> uh, Gabriel, you go to a gym? Uh, I play squash. You play squash. Interesting. Squash. I bet a lot of people don't know squash. Can you describe what squash is to everyone? Uh, it's more like a, a, a game when you play, hit the ball at the wall and the, your opponent has to get the ball without to... How do I say when the ball hits the floor? <laughs> the ball uh, can't bounces. hit the floor twice. The ball cannot bounce. Yeah, cannot bounce twice. So to everyone, I'm writing this on the left-hand side. To bounce means to touch the ground. Yeah. So... It's is it a little bit like uh, is it a little bit like tennis? Uh, we have uh, rackets too, but uh, it's more fa it's a faster game. Tennis is more it's more easy, but it's uh, easier. It's not more it's easier. easier. It's easier. Easier. Uh, where are you taping? At the chat. I'm typing in the chat. Yes. Okay. Can you see? Now I see. Yes. Okay. 
Cool. Uh, what other sports do people play here? Does anyone else play sports? Robson, you're making all the noise. Mute. Um, uh, he's gone. Okay. So, what? Who plays sports? Handball. Who plays handball? Louisa? I play volleyball. Volleyball. Who knows what volleyball is? Raise their hand. Laura, you don't know what volleyball is? Yes, I know. Yeah. Okay. So, explain to me, what makes someone good at volleyball? How are you good at volleyball? Mm, how, what, uh, what makes you good? A good player, Louisa. What makes you a good uh, volleyball player? Um, because I always give um, uh, the first. Um, uh, I can say. Yeah, you can. You can do anything. Write it down. Yeah, write it down. No, I, I don't know that word. Sorry. I will try to translate it. Um. Uh, say it. What is it? Is it? Do you have to be tall to be a good volleyball player? Do you have to hit the ball hard, like oh, very hard? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I would know that. I hit the ball hard. That's why I hit thinking. ball hard. That means to like take it and hit it, right? Yeah. So that it is. Yes, you have to concentrate on the ball, or you'll to or you'll miss. Or you'll swing and you'll miss. Um, That's why usually volleyball players have strong legs. I why like is that? Girls who play <laughs> volleyball. Girls who. Ah, play you volleyball. like girls who have strong legs. I see. It is good. Do they and need Brazil, strong? Right? Do they need strong legs so they can run away from you, Gabriel? Is that important? Uh, why? <laughs> <laughs> Just joking. Who else plays sports? Victor, do you play sports? Uh, yeah, I play soccer and boxing. Soccer and boxing, wow. Victor, show us your boxing stance. Does everyone know what a stance is? Stance? It's your defense. A stance, I'm writing it. A stance is the position that you take when you play a sport. So, Victor, stand up and give us your stance. Show me your stance. Come on. Wait, wait, wait for me. Wait for me. Victor's about to give us his stance. He's going to do his, his boxing stance. Does anyone have any questions about what a stance is? Cello, what is a stance? Boxer. Well, every sport. While he waits, while he does that, I'm going to show you my baseball stance, okay? You ready? If I'm a baseball player, I go like this. It's my stance for, mm -hmm. yeah, so I'm getting ready, and that's my, that's what I'm ready when I'm about to hit the ball. And then, Victor, show us, show me, whoa, look at Victor, everybody. Victor, show us your stance. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa! Victor Vic loves uh, Thai boxing. <laughs> yeah. So, Sela, do you play a sport? Mm, yeah, I play. What's... I play in badminton uh, and futsal. What is it? Badminton. Badminton. Bad badminton. Oh, interesting. Badminton. Who, kn who knows what badminton is here? Eris, do you know what badminton is? No, no. I heard. I have heard, but I don't know what's. Stella, can you type it for us, please? <laughs> badminton is. Uh... Hard to type. Uh, 
guys. Uh, I don't think that's how you spell it, actually. It's Pateka with racket. Yeah, it's using racket side by side, and uh, there is a net between the player. Or it uh, can be single or double, and they use uh, this hook. Hook is a uh, not a ball, but it's a uh, kind of uh, the, the I don't know. That sound. Shut shuttlecock. Shuttlecock is the shuttlecock is the um is the thing that you hit. It's like the ball. Shuttlecock is the ball yeah. in badminton. Badminton is actually a British game. It started in in um, I believe it started in uh, England or English people England, used to play it. Uh, British game. Interesting. Uh, Aris, do you play a sport? Yes, football. Football. Soccer? Like, or American football? No, no. Soccer. A real, uh, right. a, a real, real football. football, right? <laughs> what position do you play? I think I am better in defense. Louisa, you're saying he's not Aris? Who is he? No, uh, no. I am Elton's brother, Aries. Uh, is he lying to us, guys? <laughs> I All don't right. remember. They All right. Who, we're okay. going to have a vote. We're okay. going to have a vote. Look Hello. at... Here is Elson. <laughs> Hello. Hello, Lisa. This is my brother. Hi. Hello, teacher. Hello. You guys are, are you guys twins? No. <laughs> He's four years big, older than me. He's four years older than you. Yes. Huh. But I'm taller. Haha. Uh -huh. Are you stronger? <laughs> yes. <laughs> <laughs> yes, he All is. Right, well, well, there is no debate. You know the phrase, there is no debate. When you know something for certain, you say, there is no debate. <laughs> yeah. Yes. So, are you convinced, Louisa? Yeah, what do you think? <laughs> hey, Louisa, I think you, you owe them an apology. Do you know what it means to owe someone an apology? Yeah. You owe them an apology. Louisa. What? <laughs> I think for it, uh, calling him a liar. I think it's ah. <laughs> You called him a liar. No. <laughs> I just be uh, like one person. What? Uh, they're uh, so similar. I don't know. Maybe the camera is not so good, but <laughs> we are two persons. <laughs> They're not connected. Does anyone know what a Siamese twin is? Yes, I know. <laughs> What's a Siamese twin, Laura? Do you know what a Siamese twin is? Uh, are the, are, uh, when the babies uh, share a part of the body, for example, they are shown by the arm, or sometimes they are shown with the head. Um, and the different so they're parts. joined. Say the word joined. They are joined. 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 Perfect. Looks by the head or so their bodies, another way to say it, their bodies are connected. Their bodies are connected. Siamese twins. Um, interesting. Okay, who have, who, let's see, who else hasn't played a sport? Patricia, do you play a sport? You look like an athlete. Yeah, I like mm -hmm. a sport. What sport do you play? Running. Well, different sport. I, I like swim. 
I like Shoa, I like volleyball you say in the you beach. You like to swim. You say you like to swim. You say the infinitive of the verb. You like yeah. to swim. You like to play okay. football. The infinitive. No, play football, no, volleyball. Volleyball. <laughs> so say yeah. you like to play volleyball. Yeah. That's good. Um, so, I have a question. Um, does anyone know that there was a hurricane in the United States? I think it was yeah. Sandy. You think what? Sandy. Sandy, that's right. Sella, tell us what, ha what, was, what was the deal with Sandy? What happened? Uh, I don't know much, but uh, I, what I watch in the TV is uh, about uh, the big hurricane, uh, it's at the uh, east coast of the United States, as can be make a shelter uh, and of course make problem for as many as uh, five million people there. Yeah, yeah, it was. A, it's a major problem. Yeah. That's true. Um, and it, it, another word for a hurricane is a natural disaster. Natural disaster. Natural disaster. It's a. Um, it's the type of a. Uh, um, it's a type. It's like it's a way to explain. Uh, a a her so another type of a natural disaster. Who can think of another type of a natural disaster? Earthquake. Earthquake. Yep. Uh, Earthquake. What else? Floods. Floods. Say floods. 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 That's good. Floods. Natural disaster. Floods. A typhoon. That's good. Um, what other natural disasters are there? Tsunami. Tsunami. What about when an alien attacks? Is that a natural disaster? No. <laughs> Why not? Or a zombie apocalypse? It's can be a war, but I think. Alien <laughs> attack. I think an alien attack is an unnatural disaster. What do you guys think? Oh, the the alien are natural. Oh really? You know an alien? <laughs> No, I don't. Gabriel, because the U your... U.S. Army hid all the islands for us. Oh, I just kidding. I don't believe that. Are you black oh. in, in a man? Black in <laughs> what if yeah, I told like you guys it. that I was an alien? Yeah. So True. Play okay, happy Halloween. Happy holiday? <laughs> it's, it's an alien holiday? <laughs> Tomorrow will be. What? Tomorrow will be. Halloween, he said. Oh, Halloween. I, I understand. All right. Well, let's talk about Halloween. Who's gonna? Who's dressing up for Halloween? Raise their hand. No. Isn't that culture from Brazil to to dress for Halloween? It is not the culture. No. It is not the culture in Brazil, not from Brazil. Say that. Mm -hmm. It's not a culture in Brazil to dress Perfect. for Halloween. To, to dress up, you want to say. To dress up. For Halloween, yeah. Okay. Cool. Okay. So, let's see. Who's, I think, Louisa, what are you going to be for Halloween? No, nothing. I'm nothing? Patricia, are you dressing up for Halloween? <laughs> yes. Just, yes. What are you going to be? Uh, what will you dress I, up as? Do you think they say you're seeing Halloween dress now? I'm Gasparim. What, Casper? <laughs> yes, I'm Gasper. Casper. <laughs> Casper the ghost? I Gasper in a dream. Okay. Like with sheets? <laughs> what? With sheets? Like Gasper, the friendly ghost. Mm -hmm. mm. Yeah. Who else is dressing up? Let's Vanessa. What Victor? What do you think Vanessa should be for Halloween? 
What do you I think she should that? be? A vampire. Oh, man. <laughs> That's not very nice. Vampire. Oh, Vanessa, what do you think about that? Uh, well, here in Spain, in Spain, it's not a tradition too. But uh, all the years, I I like to to meet with my friends. We have a dinner, and then we go out. All of us dress up. You go out and dress up. What will you dress? What What is your costume? Everyone knows the word costume, right? Mm hmm. My, oh, um, I have. Oh, I don't know how to. Try to I, describe it. Oof, it's difficult. I have it's it's very simple this year. Mm, because I have to work the next day. On, on uh, the same day. Because my can. mother my mother can. has a florist and we have a lot of work in the florist. A, a fl she has a floral shop. Is that right? right? Yes, of florist. Floral shop. It's okay, florist too, no? Ah, uh, yeah, she's, she is a florist, but she doesn't have a florist. A florist oh, okay. is, a, is a description of... Um, the work, the job. Yes, exactly. Okay. It's not a place. Yes, my, my mother is a florist and I have to help her in the sense day. Mm -hmm. You and have to... Mm -hmm. The costume is... So simple. I am going to have a, a dress, mm -hmm. and then I have some. I don't know how to say. A ver, colmillo. I'm not sure. Uh, I'm going to look. Look. Look it up. A colmillo. I don't know what a colmillo is. A fang. Fangs. A, a thong. Fangs. No. Fangs. Fangs. I'm going to have two fangs, like here. Fangs. Ah, so you will be like <laughs> you will be like a vampire. So Victor, that was very good. You guessed right. <laughs> she, she and, she running now. Oh, she and then we are down. we are going to paint with with blood. You will what with blood? We are going to paint us. Ah, you will paint yourselves with blood. Say, you will paint our. We will paint we are, ourselves with blood. We are going to paint ourselves. Okay. Perfect. All right. Yes, real oh. blood. <laughs> well, I have a question. Each one of you should describe what I should be for Halloween, and if I like the idea, I might even do it. Gabriel, what should I be for Halloween? Uh, I don't know the name when the guy has half of the body like a horse. A and unicorn? <laughs> no, <laughs> no, unicorn. You have a, a thing in your head. It's not a unicorn. It's life. Half is a, a horse. The other half is a man. Half man, half horse. Uh, I don't know the name either. Triton. 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 I, I no. I'm not sure. They have anybody a specific know? name for this. Does anybody know? What? Centaurus. A centurion. A centurion. Centurion. Yeah. Thanks, Google. Google, everyone, thank Google, thank you, Google. <laughs> thank you, Google. Mm. Everybody, thank Google. <laughs> All right, good. Um, Makes more smart. Why should I be a centurion? I don't know. Am I strong good. like a horse? No, that's you why I look like a horse? <laughs> no, that's half of you, not all of you. Oh, I see. So only half of me looks like a horse. Yeah. I see. That makes sense. Does everyone agree? Does everyone think that I should be a centurion? Raise your no. hand if I think it should be a centurion. Who says I should not be a centurion? Uh, Lisa, I no. think uh, I think Lisa thinks you are cute. Maybe you need to be a puppy. A puppy. Uh, I can't. <laughs> I can't get it. You know who? What? Joker uh, from Batman. Batman. From Batman. Who's who from Batman? 
I Joker. Tried. The Joker. You think I should be the Joker? Why should I be the Joker? Wow. Mm. Uh, I don't know. Because I'm funny? Uh, yeah. Uh, oh, yeah. <laughs> not crazy. Uh, not because what? I don't know. <laughs> you don't know. You have no reason. You just made uh, it up. No, I think uh, I don't know. Yeah. Um. Interesting. Uh. Okay. You just have a feeling. You just. You just. Uh, you just. It just came to you immediately. It just was. Uh. Someone could say. Well. It was, uh, you had a uh, epiphany. Does anyone know what an epiphany is? It's like a, a, anyone know what an epiphany is? Victor, what's an epiphany? Mm, I've heard it before, but I don't remember. Anybody? <laughs> Louisa? Laura? What is an epiphany? Epiphany, a revelation. Exactly right. Vanessa. What's a revelation? <laughs> Anybody know what a revelation is? Reborn? Well, to reveal is a verb, yes. So you're getting close. Well, what do you think? Ahmad, are you there? Yeah, I'm there. Hi. Do you have a yeah. guess? What a re what is a revelation? Uh, you know, I, I just come here and uh, I don't know the, the topic. Oh, it's okay. We're we're asking what is the definition? Definition of uh, revelation. Revelation. Are you Muslim, um, um, Ahmad? Yeah, yeah, I'm Muslim. I think your prophet had a revelation. That might be a hint. Uh, you know, uh, some countries in Arab countries have a revolution. They want to change. They want to change the uh, the king. They want to change oh, the whole. That, like that. that's a revolution. Oh, I got strong. I think if if a revolution is uh, is when you when you discover something new. Talk to the prophet. Revolution. So a revelation. Revelation is like when your girlfriend tells for you that he. It's leaving you, <laughs> or maybe <laughs> no, that's when he tells to you like he has another guy. <laughs> I think I think usually your girlfriend is a she. I'm not sure about that, but usually you say my girl. She says something, not he. Okay. Um, it's because a girl, right? Yeah. When uh, when she tells you that uh, she is pregnant. That that's that. I would call that a surprise. These are all yeah. these are all unwelcome surprises. But um, a revelation is exactly what Could Vanessa. Could be a revelation if she say to you that she is not she is he. No, that that would be that. That would be a um, uh, a a big surprise. I would say. A revelation is, um, yeah, in some ways it's a surprise, but it's something that you that uh, you just instantly realize. You have a moment where you instantly realize something. Oh, okay. When we have a lamp. Yeah, an inspiration. It's like when a light goes off in your head. A great like, idea. Whoa, I just realized something. So I was asking Louisa if she just had this inspiration, a revelation that I should be... A Joker for Halloween. So is that is that true, Louisa? Okay. All right. So Laura, what should I be for Halloween? Hmm? Um, I and think why? you you have to be a werewolf. Oh, well, because werewolf. you have the beard, you hmm. messy your hair. Are you, you saying my hair is messy and I, I look I look disheveled? Does everyone know the word disheveled? <laughs> Does anyone know the word disheveled? Disheveled? Yeah. I woke up disheveled. <laughs> that's, that's probably right. 
<laughs> Can you explain what disheveled means, Gabriel? Uh, it's like I have a disheveled hair, like you can see. And in the morning, my I have a big mess at the top of my head. Yeah, the shovel means messy and like, like confused. The shovel is messy and confused. So Laura's telling me I'm disheveled. It's not very nice to call my dear teacher disheveled. <laughs> I don't say that. Mm. You said my hair is messy. That I got no, a beard. I, I think you should messy your hair. I should mess you... it up even more. Yes. All right, I'm gonna mess up my hair even more. Nah, didn't really work. My hair doesn't move. Anterior clothes. Say that again. Can you write that? Uh, broke your clothes. Here. Excuse me. <coughs> Broke my clothes? What do you mean? Because the werewolf is a man that become a wolf. And he dressed like a man and when he become a wolf he has the all his clothes uh, tears. Make tears uh, broke. Mm -hmm. No understand. Oh his clothes rip. Ah, yeah. To rip. So, so a werewolf's clothes, clothes, rip. So they they get ripped. They they tear, rip or tear. To rip and tear means to get holes in them. So usually you can you can also tear a piece of paper. Yeah, I just tore I just tore a piece of paper. Cool, huh? Alright. So I'm not sure why I should be a werewolf, but I guess you think that I look disheveled. Fine. We're not gonna that's enough out of you. Okay. Uh, Patricia, what should I be for Halloween? What should be my what should be my costume? You understand what? the question? For, no, for Halloween. What should I be for Halloween? What should be my costume for Halloween? Like you're Casper, what should I be? When I say I saw say something, no. I like Halloween. Yeah. What should mm. I be for Halloween? What should um, my costume it's, be? It's, um, a holiday day and you need to stay for the kids, no? Yeah. In the night, the kids come to the house and the people, uh, I don't know. What should be, what should be my costume? Should I be a ghost? Should I be a werewolf, like Laura said? Should I be... Uh, a joker, like Louisa said? Is, uh, the costume is, um, can be dressed different and, um, and give the chocolate for the kid, for example, no? Um, <laughs> Vanessa's writing it in Spanish. De todo. <laughs> I uh, don't know. You don't know? Are you? Um, I see... Hmm. No. Clothes? I'm not a machine. <laughs> a machine? <laughs> <laughs> I should be a machine? <laughs> oh God! Sounds funny. No, I don't imagine what you. Oh, I don't imagine it. Oh, you can't imagine. <laughs> yeah. Ah, it's hard to imagine what I. Huh. Well, I'm gonna give you some time to think about it. You think. 
I'm gonna go. At, I'm gonna ask Sella what he thinks I should be, but you think about it, okay? Okay. Mm -hmm. Uh, Sella, what should I be for Halloween? For you? Mm-hmm. What should I be? Yeah. Okay. Because you look uh, muscular enough, so I suggest you to use uh, a Batman custom. I should be a Batman. I should be Batman. Batman but but but, uh, but you must bring a, a broomstick. Okay. So you can fly. That's a witch. <laughs> yes. So you can uh, look like flying with a broomstick. <laughs> Batman doesn't need a broomstick. Batman <laughs> flies around in an awesome car. <laughs> he doesn't need a broom. I think that's a good combination. It's a good combination. I don't know. And why do you think I should be? It sounds like I should be Bat Witch. It's a new superhero. Bat Witch. Da 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 da. Bat Witch. Bat Witch. And I go around on a on broom. Seems a little crazy to me, but why should I be Bat Witch? <laughs> Victor, what are you talking about over there? Yeah. Victor, what are you talking about? Uh, Victor is a novel uh, character. In a novel, or you mean a unique character? A unique character. Ah, I thought you meant was a character in a novel. Yeah. Like a book. All right, you guys, I think are all crazy. Um, let's see what Vanessa thinks. Vanessa, what should I dress up as? I think you should dress up of Billy. Do you know who is? I don't know who Billy is. Oh, Billy, Billy is, is Billy is the is the doll of Soul. Do you watch this movie? Did you the watch this doll movie? of Soul? So it's a it's a, a terror Billy? film. I know it's a movie. Oh, like uh, you mean the guy that kills people with saws? No, no, the the doll. He's a doll. Is the doll from of the? Oh, the those very scary movies. Yeah. Where he's the doll that kills um, people. It's very simple because you have the hair, and you only have to put you a mask. <laughs> so you're saying I'm a serial killer. You guys like, I, rem I look like a serial killer to you, huh? That's really <laughs> nice of you guys. I'm no. <laughs> I, and you oh, didn't man. realize, but the, the I hair worked of so the hard to teach you guys awesome. English, and oh, all of fair. you, Laura thinks I look like a disheveled freak. <laughs> you know, Louisa thinks I look like a, a joker because I'm not serious. Patricia has no idea what I should be. And Sella. What do you think I should do? Oh yeah, one. Oh yeah, Gabriel thinks I'm a horse. <laughs> Looks like a horse. And Sella, what did you say again? Bet oh you. yeah, I should be a wit, a witcher, a ma between a witch and a Batman, because I'm apparently a witch. And Vanessa thinks I'm a serial killing doll. I can't wait to see what Victor has to say. Victor, what should I be? Uh, I think. Uh, <laughs> You should be Brooklyn and uh, with a yellow jumpsuit. I should be Bruce Lee with a yellow jumpsuit? Just, yeah. Does everyone know who Bruce Lee is? Oh, yeah. Yes. But the yellow, what? Yeah, I don't get the yellow either. <laughs> <laughs> yellow suit. Yellow suit. Why? Yeah. Oh, it's his day, not mine. It's, uh, explain, Victor. I don't understand what you're what you're saying. Oh, uh, I said you should be Brooklyn with uh, a yellow jumpsuit. But why a yellow jumpsuit? Uh, it's the most famous <coughs> yeah, cloth of Bruce Lee. Oh, really? I didn't know that. Interesting. Okay. Because my name is Lee. I should be Bruce Lee. So do you think everyone with the name Lee should be Bruce Lee? Is that right? 
So that means that, like, what, 20% of China should all dress up like Bruce Lee? <laughs> hmm? uh, I think uh, you should be just... If you wear that, that jump shield, it, uh, it would be ridiculous. It would be ridiculous if I dressed up as Bruce Lee. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Hmm. Well, you know what? Here's my job. I'm going to tell you guys what you <laughs> should be for Halloween. Okay. <laughs> All right. Gabriel, you should be... I need some help with him. He's a little, he's a little tough to see. I think he should be um, that guy from... Yeah, okay. Now it's, it's better. You should be the guy from that 70s show. Does everyone know oh. what that is? You should be a guy, you should be like you're in the 70s. You think that you're like uh, a 70s, you should be a 70s porn star. <laughs> 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 All right, moving on. Laura, 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 Laura. What should you be for? You should be Matilda. Matilda? Uh-huh. The girl that makes magic? I don't know. I just came. I came out of that. I just made that up. Actually, I have no idea who Matilda is, but I think you well. look like Matilda. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Moving on. You're Matilda, or uh, or the woman from Harry Potter, who Herm Hermione, 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 from Harry Potter. Louisa, Louisa, Louisa. I think I need some help, guys. What should Louisa be? Genie. Hmm. Genie. Genie. She kind of looks like a genie. That's a really good one. All right, she should be a genie. You're going to be a genie. Mm -hmm. um, mm -hmm. Patricia. What should Patricia be for Halloween, everyone? Let's see. I think Patricia should be... I think you'd be a really good vampire. Or Catwoman. That's perfect. Catwoman. Catwoman. Patricia is going to be Catwoman. Good one. You got that. You nailed that, I would say. Does everyone know what I mean when I say, you nailed that? I think Victor nailed that. What does that mean when I say it? It's an idiom. I, what does it mean when I say, you nailed that? It's like great shot. Yeah, it means you got that exactly right. You nailed that means you got that exactly right. Um, Grad, are you there? Yes, hello. Oh, hi, how are you? Fine. So I think, we're, you know what we're doing right now? We're coming up with ways to figure out who, who everyone should be for Halloween. Yes, OK. And I think, let's see, I think Grad, he should be an invisible man. It's pretty obvious. Yes, uh, because I will go to sleep. You're going to go to sleep? Yes. I will go to sleep in Halloween. Why? All day long you will sleep? No, that's are, you a, are you a... That, 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 that that nocturnal? Nocturnal. What does nocturnal mean? Anybody know? Nocturnal. We're living in the night. Yes, people that sleep yeah. during the day. I am the sun. Yes, you got it. <laughs> Woo, Patricia, everyone clap for Patricia. Very good. Patricia got that exactly right. Nocturnal means... Um, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yes, exactly. You nailed Not, that. What? And nailed that. Yeah, you exactly. You nailed that, Patricia. Patricia nailed that. So yes, it's someone who sleeps uh, at night, uh, or rather sleeps during the day and is awake at night. Nocturnal. So or nocturnal. Vampire. Yeah, vampires are, are nocturnal. Bats are nocturnal. Um, all right. Anyway, Brad, where are you from? I'm from Lithuania. Lithuania. Cool. It's so far Luth from you. Yeah, I know where Lithuania is. It's near Louisa, isn't it? 
Louisa, is Lithuania near you? No. Oh. Is Europe? I'm a stupid American, so I thought it was. It's across ocean. Across the ocean. Yeah, it's it's it's. I thought it was. It used to be part of the USSR, right? Yes, and maybe 15 years ago or more. Mm -hmm. Cool. Is this your first time on Polingo? The uh, second today. Second time. Yes, today is second time. Great. Well, welcome. Thanks. Uh, you should come more. It's fun. All right. Moving on here. Let's see. What were we just talking about? What should Sela be? Sela hmm. for Halloween. I think you're you're actually. Vic, do you have any ideas? <laughs> a cricket? You think he should be a cricket? That's no. weird. <laughs> oh, I know, I know, I know, I know. Louisa, what do you got? What should he be, Louisa? <laughs> Tin Woodman. Oh, that's actually really good. Louisa nailed that. You should be uh, the, no, I think, what if, he should be the, uh, the guy from um, Wizard of Oz? You mean like the Tin Man? Uh, I'm sorry. Who's Tin Woodman? I don't know. From, uh, from book for children. From what book? From book, uh, the name in English, I don't know. Anybody know? I yeah. think it's Wizard of Oz. Yeah. Wizard of Oz. Yes, yes. Whoa. <laughs> that's Look scary. like this? Yeah, yeah, that's, that's scary. <laughs> uh, no, I think you should be the Tin Man from the Wizard of Oz. That's exactly what would be good. The tall, thinny guy. I don't think he has a crazy beard, Sella. All right, we nailed that. You nailed that, Louisa. All right, what should Vanessa be? Dun, dun, dun. Vanessa. Vanessa. I can't, it's hard to see Vanessa. I don't really know what she looks like. <laughs> okay. She looks like a... Yeah, that's... Okay. Let's see. What should Vanessa be? Uh, be good. <laughs> witch. A witch? You think she should be a witch? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> uh, um. No, witch again, no. Last year I dressed up like a witch, and this year I have to change. Uh. You, you should be a, last year, a Little Red Riding Hood. I like that idea. Laura, explain why. I don't know. She has a, a the hair is like a, with a tone of red, so that will be nice. <laughs> I don't know. Yeah. That's, I think that's a good one. With red toned I, hair. Yeah, I, don't so what do you think about is, that? I don't know who is. I don't know who is. I'm going to. You don't know who that. You don't know who that is. Caperucita roja. Ah. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Why? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> but this is a scare. Is this a scare? Um. Normally, the customers of Halloween used to scare, no? Uh, interesting. Mm. Yes, square, scared, square, scared, scared. Well, I don't. I, I'm, I'm mumbling. I just lost my. <laughs> I don't even. I don't even know what I'm talking about. Sorry. I got an email. I got distracted. Sorry, guys. Got distracted. All right, Vanessa. Let's. What should Victor be? Hmm. Victor's a little bit of. He's a little devilish. That I know of him. Does everyone know what I mean by that? Victor is a little like a devil. I think you should just be the devil. What do you think of that? 
Brad, you have an opinion? Does he look like the devil to you? Yes, because he in the dark room. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, he's in his cave. He's, he's evil. He says he types things to people that are mean sometimes. Yes. He's a little sneaky. Yeah, uh, yeah. I think he's the devil. Yes, always smiling. Always smiling and plotting. Does everyone know what I mean by plotting? <laughs> what does it mean when I say plotting? Plotting. Louisa wants to be a witch. Plotting means like planning evil things, like coming up with evil ideas. Um, so yeah, I think you're basically the devil. How do you feel about that? What kind of devil? There are so many uh, devils. I think, no, there's the devil. Ah, the devil. Oh, I know it. With uh, two horns? Uh, two horn? Two horns, yeah, yeah, yeah. In fact, I think you can actually put it on to your, your screen. Go into the effects. And let's see here. You guys see it, right? See? I'm the devil now. You need to put on the costume. What the hell is that sound? <laughs> yes, exactly. You're, you're perfect. That's your costume. You should go out like that. See? Doesn't it look perfect for him? He's the devil. <laughs> All right. Does anyone have any questions for me about Halloween, about English? About how to make pasta. No, you're not. You're not an angel. Sorry, buddy. Uh, <laughs> anybody have any questions about San Francisco? Because we have we have five, ten more minutes left in class. Anybody have any questions about chicken fried rice? So I'm an expert on chicken fried rice. I don't know if you knew that. <laughs> I am. I'm an, I'm a chicken fried rice expert. Anybody have any questions? Does anyone have anything to say? Anybody have a statement to make? Does everyone what know what are I mean you by going make a statement? To cook? What am I going to cook? Yeah, you, you are in the kitchen. I am in the kitchen. What are you going to cook? I have a secret to tell you. You promise not to tell anyone, Laura? Okay, we're, it's, I will we're just, try. it's just you and I are talking, right? And it's not on YouTube, right? This is not, is yeah. this on YouTube? No, of course. Bye, Vanessa. This is not on YouTube, right? So no one knows this secret if I tell this secret to people? Is that right, nope. everyone? My lips are sealed. My lips are sealed. The secret is I haven't cooked in like four years. <gasps> really bad, I know. I'm, it's a terrible. Oh, oh. You know woe is me when you say woe is me. That means the world is terrible and oh. I'm so bad, but I've been so busy that I don't. I so I eat out so much. I eat outside, and it makes me fat. See, um, but I don't cook. I used to have a girlfriend that cooked for me. She was good, but I'm the worst cook ever. So that is the secret. But you won't tell anyone, Laura, right? Okay. You you won't tell Victor. Or you won't tell Stella. Or you won't tell Patricia. Sure. Or you won't tell Louisa or Gabrielle, right? Yeah. Give me a second. No. Okay. They are thinking about another thing. They're 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 thinking about other things. Mm -hmm. <laughs> right. So what do you need a kitchen for? Interesting idea. That, that would be what the devil says. <laughs> Victor, you are so the devil. Uh, what do I need a kitchen for? Well, I need a kitchen for so people think that I cook. So girls, when they when they're here, they think, "Oh, he has a nice kitchen. He must cook." And I say, "Sure." That's what I say. That's why. Does that make sense? That's a devilish answer. A devilish answer. Um. Anyone else have any questions for me?
No, it's okay. Well, you know what I'm going to really be? I'm going to be a farmer for Halloween. Really? I have overalls. Is that Zoom B farmer? I'm going to be a farmer. I have a, I have a farmer's hat, and I'm going to have some hay in my mouth, and I'm going to sell expensive uh, fruit to people at a farmer's I, market. I have another suggestion. What's that, devil? You could be a hipster. I could be what? A hipster. Let's write it. Hipster. Hipster. <laughs> yep. Uh, I think that that is uh, that is possible. I mean, the thing is, everyone in my neighborhood is a hipster, so it wouldn't be that really that crazy. Um, you must be hipsters with iPhone. Hipsters with iPhone. Hipsters love iPhones. It's their favorite thing. <laughs> yeah. Instagram, iPhone, Facebook. No, you um, must be scary. That's fine. Uh, I must be scary? Yeah. <laughs> I am scary. <laughs> no, it's not scary. No. It's not scary? No. No. All right, I'm going to go work on that. Next time you see me, I'll be scary, I promise. All right, guys. Peace out. Good class? All right. Thank you. All right. Okay, see you. Go on to the day. next class. Tell everyone about Colingo. You love it. Woo! <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Bye-bye.